Hello, welcome. Welcome back if you're a current subscriber. Welcome if you're new. I have a small haul from Bath and Body Works. I went there yesterday because they had the single wicks for $5.95. And if you guys have seen my candle collection, I have enough, but there was a few I wanted to grab. So let's start with the one that I went in there looking for. Now, Diane um, here on YouTube and Instagram had shared um, that her love for this moonlit graveyard. Now they don't put scent notes on these small ones, but I think it's like moss, earthy. I don't know, but they had this sitting like this without a lid and I found it and it was by the display of all the Halloween stuff, but I kind of thought, well, maybe it's not for sale. I was like for $5.95, I'll take it. It is very good. Too bad. They don't have any more of these. Oh, I would love a dupe of this in vendor wax. I can't wait to burn this. So this one I'm actually going to work on. I have a candle right now going that, um, because I'm trying to work on some candles. All right. And then I got, um, bourbon maple, which again, doesn't say, but this is from the white burn one. And I smelled this and obviously I went to the store, duh. I didn't want to order online just because they didn't have that moonlit great moonlit graveyard one online and so i thought well maybe i'll it'll be there of course it wasn't this is very good bourbon maple it smells great i like the cute little candle okay and then i got ghoul friend i didn't get this last year i got the pumpkin carving one so this is berry like dark berries I think it's maybe plum. I thought maybe I'll get the big one in this, but I'm just not the biggest fan of Halloween. So I thought these were cute. I could use these. I think they said they have enough burn as the three wicks. Uh, so I just thought I would give this one a try. See what I think of it burning. Last but not least, I got strawberry pound cake, which I know is very surprising, right? Because I don't generally like strawberry pound cake. But this was so strong in the store and I thought for a single wick I can do this in my bedroom when I work nights sometimes I will put a candle and I move everything away from it because you know I'm so paranoid and it'll be right next to my bed and I will burn it and I only sleep for like five hours so then I burn it out but I see the Amazon Prime truck right there I don't think he's coming to my house but you never know so anyway, this was great. And I thought for that price, why not? And then I did have a free hand cream, which I got in Luminous. Now this is a new scent. I just saw it all over my app. And I was going to get the candle, but then when I smelled this, I'm like, I this, this is way too perfumey for me. Uh, so I thought, well... Try it in the hand gel or hand cream and see what you think. It's definitely girly perfume heavy scent. So I will just stick this up here and use it before I do videos because it was free. Why not? I, I like to try new scents when I'm getting a free item just because then I think that is the best time to try them. So that was my small bath and body. And then I'm going to share what I picked up at Walmart. So I went into Walmart the other night. I had to also pick up my son from work after working. Oh my gosh, whatever, long story. But anyway, so I went in there and I got kind of a mixture of things because when I went there, they didn't have a, they had some fall stuff out, but not a ton. So I thought, well, I'll just, this gives me the perfect opportunity while I was waiting for him to smell some scents. So I did get sweet berry cupcake. So it says fluffy and frosted. I don't think these have scent notes. No. Nope. So this one is sensational. And this has like a burnt kind of cupcake scent, which I kind of like. You know how when you make your cupcakes and if you get them a little bit done, a little overdone, like a little brown, they get that little crunchy note that you can smell. It kind of has that with the berries. So I like that one. And then I got warm spring sunshine. Now this is better home and garden. Um, so this one is white peach, daisy, granny, smith, apple, rainwater, melon, garden, floral, amber, scent notes. So my, yeah, right? Why am I get this? This was just a pretty floral with that peach. I could get a lot of the peach in this. 
oops, I don't know how we'll perform, but I thought I would give it a try, so why not? They're two dollars or whatever they are now. Okay, the rest are sensationals. I got uh, honeysuckle nectar, <laughs> nectars, honeysuckle nectar. This is a floral. This is lovely. I was so glad that I went into the store. Sometimes I will order these and do a pickup. This is very strong. I don't know that I would get any more. I'll warm it and see what I think. And then I got Feeling Cozy, which is warm woods and crisp apple. And I loved this graphic. Like this just screams fall to me. This is good. This kind of gives me like a oud note. I so many scents smell like vanilla oud from Scentsy for me. And this one really kind of did. Not on the bottom. I get more like of a... Um, that's where that apple note is. And the top I get kind of that oud. And the bottom I get more of that apple note. So thought I would try that. And last but not least, I know this is a beloved of so many. So I wanted to try iced lemon sugar cookies. A soft and chewy citrus treat. Ooh, this is strong. That's so strong. Last time at Christmas when they they were a dollar, I stocked up. But I didn't get a great performance on those. Oh my gosh, I can't get this out. But I thought I'll just try them and see because these are the classic ones, I think, kind of. Oh, that's so strong. I can see why I've seen so many people have this in their empties because this is so, so strong. Okay. So that's what I had for my little bath and body and then my retail wax. I just wanted to share that with you just because sometimes I honestly will order things and then I just don't share them with you, which I don't need to share every little haul with you, but I wanted to come on and just say hello and touch base because I have a couple of videos I pre-recorded, which will be coming up, but I wanted to get this out today just because I knew it wasn't going to be a longer video and I know some of those candles, maybe that, um, Moonlit graveyard you can find near you. I would love more of this. This is just beautiful. But you gotta like earthy, damp kind of scents. This is really good. Mm. Thank you, Diane, for that suggestion. I love that. So I work again tonight. I'm gonna actually go down and have lunch now, upload this video, and then I'm gonna go take a nap before my son gets home from school because, like I said, I do work. Um, I am completely off orientation. I did work all weekend long. Um, a little stressed. I literally could have cried because I just, it's like I said, it's been a long time since I worked in a hospital and then working in OB because it is like everything is done so quickly. Like if somebody comes in and they're in labor and you're getting all these things done or if a baby is born, you have to, you know, you're all the steps that go in to make sure the baby comes out and cries and is doing well after delivery. So anyway, um, and then, um, I do have some more next week. I will be gone again for a couple days doing NICU training again. So working in the neonatal intensive care unit again. So I am looking forward to that. I really did enjoy that too bad that NICU is not a little closer. It's like an hour and 20 some minute drive. Um, boy, is it a great place. I'm just working with those babies and the parents and it's definitely high paced, but you're working with one patient, you know, well, not one patient, you have two to three patients depending on severity. But I just think sometimes on labor and delivery, you're, you generally have two, pa two patients who you're worried about. You have the mom in labor and then the baby. As soon as that baby comes out and cries, I'm like, okay, we're good. You know, 99% of the time babies are good anyway, but just that 1% you worry about like, am I going to have to do a full resuscitation? But that's why we do lots of drills and trainings. And I know I'm rambling, but I just wanted to, I just wanted to talk. I, like I said, I haven't posted a newer video. I did, um, I do have several pre-orders coming or not pre-orders, but well, I did place several pre-orders. But I also placed um, an order with that smell good shop that should be coming, I don't know, probably not till the end of the month. And then, because I did all, um, not customs, but I just did where you can order them yourself. Um, and then I did order um, some K's. I did place an order. And then I did several pre-orders. But I have really been trying to do 
be better about where I'm spending my money and really looking at using up my wax and enjoying it because I don't want the scent to go away in it. It's not like it's forever. So I'm really trying to work hard on warming what I have and enjoying what I have. Um, but I hope you guys are all doing well. I love seeing all your videos. Um, my throat is a little off. I was sick for a little, a couple days and then, um, didn't take my reflux medicine. And this is just what happens because, um, that's just the way it goes with my stress and reflux. It ends up affecting my vocal cords. So anyway, I seriously am rambling. This is forever and ever, but I just hope you guys are all doing well. I love reading your comments. And I do feel like in those, in the comments, we have conversations. I love listening to what you're sharing. I just want to thank you guys all so much for going and giving Marcy some love on her channel. It really means a lot to me to know, to see the love and support in the community and to see so many people um, just spreading that love. And I, I, I know that I used to share highlights on my weekly empties of a new, like a, a YouTuber that I watch. And I'm sorry that I've been slacking in that, but I really do hope that you go look at my community tab and check out Marcy's channel. She is so kind. She is so sweet. I just hope you guys can go give her some love and, um, cause she has such great content. I love her voice and her personality. She is like a ray of sunshine. I feel like I'm the cloud. <laughs> She's the sunshine. So please go check her out and share some love. I just love seeing so many women and men lift each other up in the community. And uh, I do appreciate that very much that uh, we all are just, the people are so kind. So, um, okay. I say um, one more time, I'm going to scream. I hope you guys are all doing well and enjoying this fall weather. I know so many of you are. With that being said, I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed day.